This indicator measures growth of the property tax levy, which is the largest revenue source for the vast majority of communities. Tracking the levy's growth over time is especially important in determining the continued strength and dependability of a municipality's revenue stream. Any debt or capital exclusions must be subtracted from the tax levy when monitoring this indicator, as these funds are restricted to a particular capital project and will expire at the end of the borrowing term. Like the two prior indicators, this indicator tracks the total amount of revenue adjusted for inflation, as well as the revenue source as a percentage of total revenues. Tracking the levy as a percentage of total revenues could reveal the operating budget's increasing reliance on property tax revenue. While a constant dollar decrease will show that the property tax has not been rising sufficiently to counter the effects of inflation, a nominal dollar decrease likely signals declining property values and may indicate significant fiscal stress on the horizon. This indicator measures the ability of a community to raise taxes within the limits of Proposition 2 and a half. The purpose of this indicator is to analyze the relationship that exists between the levy ceiling, levy limit, and levy. It also shows excess capacity, which is the difference between the amount a community can legally levy and the amount it chooses to levy. Factors such as property value fluctuations and the level of excess capacity in a community play a role in its ability to raise property tax revenue. For instance, because this community's levy ceiling has declined, it has hit its maximum allowable levy on several occasions, which may have limited its ability to raise its levy, if not for its additional excess capacity. For more information on Proposition 2.5, please refer to resources available on DLS's website, including a video playlist that walks through the law's various components. This indicator measures the total assessed value of property by class within a community. Measuring the trend of residential, commercial, industrial, and personal property class values are key to a community's ability to raise revenue through its property tax levy, especially since the levy ceiling is 2.5% of assessed value under Prop 2.5.